Hello and welcome. My name is Mark Laputa and I want to talk to you today about how I create the work for my tensile series. The series happens in a lot of stages and the first stage is to make what's called a color cup or a stuff cup. What I focus on in this stage is different colors and overlapping of colors to create new shades. Generally I begin with a opaque color over a transparent color and once this stage is cool I bring it into the cold shop where I use different diamond wheels that I have here to show you. These wheels just have diamonds on the surface and they are used to remove color and create patterns. I have a couple of finished cups here that I'll use at a later date, but you can see that I've used these diamond tools to remove material and create a pattern. So the diamond tools just cut and remove color. There's a different one here with a different profile of wheel. So once these cups are done being ground, I heat them up in the hot shop where I take a large uh, bubble and I stuff it inside. You gotta do it just right so you don't make any mistakes or trap air bubbles. Once that's done, I inflate it. And as I inflate it, I can manipulate the way the pattern behaves. At that point, I make what is called a blank, which is just a basic form. Um, at this point, I'm focusing on the basic form, but also the way I can stretch the glass or blow the glass to manipulate the pattern for the final form. You can see here. So once that blank is cool and I'm ready to do the final stage, I begin cutting and using different diamond tools to work on the final form, which is the main focus of the last stage. Grinding the final form and removing material just the same way a stone sculptor would sculpt his stone. As I go through the different grits and get finer and finer, all the cuts begin to take on a polished appearance and at that stage I'm focusing not only on the form and the polish but also the way that the glass is going to manipulate and bend light. You can see from this piece called Candescent, that's all finished. You can see how the cuts bend the light and create optics, which is something I heavily focus on in my artwork. Thank you for taking the time to watch, and I hope you enjoyed the work.